Hello, welcome back to the channel. Uh, we've not done a pizza video because we've had COVID. I'm beginning to feel better. At least I'm still feeling a bit poorly. So today, we're not using pizza oven. We're going to make some muffins because there's always nothing really like a nice bit of sugar when you feel a bit ill. I'm so glad I'm feeling better. At least I should be better soon, hopefully. And then we'll be back to doing nice pizzas and things like that. But for now, let's make some nice muffins instead. Okay, we need quite a few ingredients for this. I'm actually half in this recipe, but I'll tell you the full recipe. And then if you want to half it, you can half it. The full recipe makes 12 muffins. And the half recipe obviously makes 6. So we're going to have 375 grams of self-raising flour. You also need 4 teaspoons of a uh, baking powder you need cinnamon which is round about a teaspoon half a teaspoon of nutmeg you also need 120 ml of vegetable oil which is what this is you also need 240 ml of milk we've got skimmed milk here and you need sugar as well obviously 200 grams of sugar I'm going to put some white chocolate chips in this one but I'm also going to put some blueberries and another of the muffins. So I'm going to do two blueberry muffins. I'm going to do four white chocolate chips. So just throw the flour in like so. And then we'll put the rest of the ingredients in as well. The vegetable oil, the cinnamon, the bacon powder and all of it. It's all going in. So we'll put it all in now. Okay, so once you have all the ingredients in, I forgot to say, you will need to add two eggs. If you're having the recipe, you only need one egg. What we're going to do is just mix that all up, and then we're going to put in our chocolate chips and our blueberries. So as you can see, it's all mixed up. The oven's preheated to 220 degrees Celsius. So what we're going to do now is just take one of these ice cream scoops and put one of them into the muffin trays and then I'll show you what's next. As you can see, I've filled two of the muffin trays, the rest remain empty. The reason for that is I'm now going to push some blueberries into these two. And then these four are going to be white chocolate and lemon. So the first thing we're going to do is make the lemon. So we're going to mix some lemon, just half a lemon, into here with a little bit of lemon rind. And then we're going to add the white chocolate to this part. And then we'll come back and we'll just put the blueberries into these two. Okay, so as you can see, we've put the lemon rind in, we've put some lemon just and some white chocolate chips. So we're just going to mix that up and then we're going to put it in there and then just finish it all off, including the blueberry ones. Okay, so as you can see, I've pushed some blueberries into these two with my hands and then these ones here are just white chocolate chip with lemon. So what I do to differentiate them is I'll just sprinkle some oats on top of these two and then we can put them in the oven. Now what I generally do is bake these for about 25 minutes. I do 225 degrees for five minutes and then 190 degrees for another 20 and then they're done. Okay and the muffins are done. Now the blueberry ones did take a little bit longer than the white chocolate ones because there was frozen blueberries in them so it did take a little bit longer for them to cook. But they smell really nice. The white chocolate one, it was quite plain on top as you can see because I never put anything on top of it. But the chocolate's oozing in the middle. So you just need to leave them to sit for a little while to cool. And then you can eat them. Now personally I prefer the blueberry muffins cold. I think they're really nice cold. So I can't wait to try that. Whereas obviously the white chocolate one, it's quite nice to cut it open. And see it all melty and oozy in the middle. But yeah, that's how you make them. It's really simple. Remember to like, subscribe. We'll see you next time. Bye.